Zanzibar. And whereabouts are you from? Zanzibar. 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 Sasa unaongea Swahili? Yes, naongea Swahili. Sasa mimi ni mimi ni mzungu lakini naweza kuongea Swahili. Barking in Essex, believe it or not. Uh, I've made the vital mistake of stopping in the Witherspoons on the way uh, to have a pint because it couldn't be, I couldn't resist it. I literally came out of the train station and up on the left hand side was a Witherspoons and uh, £2.60 a pint. You know what? It was tempting enough for me to stop and to find out a little bit about this place, uh, what barking's all about. I've basically come down here today to do. Um, a video on a little street store selling East African food, Tanzanian, Kenyan food, really authentic stuff and really looking forward to that one. Barking, from what I've heard so far, uh, has got a few things going for it. Uh, red light district, um, used to be known as the, the Grinder Killer territory. So anyway, here I am in sunny, well not so sunny, it was raining <coughs> earlier on, but in Barking and I've decided to stop off at Woodspoons for a little bit of Dutch courage so to speak and hopefully I'll be able to get on my way and make this video of this little street um, street food mart, street food stall uh, before I get too busy. Let's see how this let's see how this one progresses. So yeah, that's uh, my entrance into Barking. Barking mad, I guess, this place is, from what I've seen so far. But, you know what? That's my kind of place. Doesn't make it a bad place. So I've never been to Barking before. I've actually come down here looking for some street food. East African street food at that. And, uh, Worst case scenario, I guess we just have to find a little boozer and settle ourselves down for the day. Lovely afternoon. It was raining a little bit earlier on, but that seems to have cleared up. So yeah, this is Barking High Street. As I say, never been here before. How you doing, mate? And this is Barking. What have you got to say about Barking, mate? Lovely place. One cigar. Oh, a big arrow. Where are you from? You from? English. Bulgaria. Bulgaria. Yeah. Nice to meet you, mate. Good to see you. Thank you very much. God bless you. How very nice is that?
How you doing, mate? All right. come here today is because I'm in search of an East African, mainly Tanzanian little food stall, um, street market, uh, street food vendor, street food. And apparently this little wagon has got some tradi traditional African, East African street food. It's also going to be a little bit of a surprise, which may surprise him as much as you. Let's go and have a look and see what this is all about. So I'm here today at the Karabuni Zanzibar hot food restaurant. What time do you close, my friend? We close at seven. Seven, and what kind of food are you doing? East African food, is it? Yeah, East African food. Kenyan, East African, Tanzanian? Kenyan, Kenyan, Tanzanian. That's and kind of Asian food as well, it's kind of Middle East. Right, and do you do like chai, or cups of tea and? No, we don't do a cup of tea. But, but you do mandazi? Mandazi, chapati. And whereabouts mandazi. are you from? Zanzibar. Zanzibar. Sasa unaongea Swahili? Yes, naongea Swahili. Sasa mimi ni mzungu lakini na wesko ongea Swahili. Sasa mzee, na wesko na tengeneza hiyo mix moja. Hili ni kuku na nyama ama ni paketi? Kuku na nyama, eh. Kuku na nyama na chips. Alangu, hiyo pia ni nataka mandazi moja. Kapaka ya? Eh, na kitu gani una wesko recommend? Kitu gani ngine? Iko japati, iko kabab. I will chips, please, my friend. Gani una sema? Gani gani una sema? Mina jaribu. Sema juice. Ya ufaju. Hilo ya Kenya. Hiyo ni kabila gani? Wewe soma. Wewe hujui kusoma. Nitasoma. Unajua kusoma Kiswahili. Nitasoma nitaingilia. Unajua English, najua Kiswahili. Mzee asante sana. Then go up and so I've just ordered a mixed um, meat and chicken dish. African style with some chips. Um, I've got this funny little drink as well. Not quite sure what it is. Mama's tamarind juice. Tamarind juice. Do you want on me? Let's have a little try of that and see what it comes out like. I'll tell you what. I like that. I like that a lot. That is really nice. What do you like? Just chicken? Probably a vodka in there. Go, wouldn't go amiss either. Really nice. New one on me. Tamarind juice. If you're over down in um, Barking Market and you come to the Karabuni Zanzibar hot style, don't forget. Ask for tamarind juice. It is really nice. I've been fortunate, fortunate enough to meet up some uh, East African fellow 
yeah. uh, fellow friends, and your name is? Chef Aizy. Chef Aizy. Yeah. Yeah. Chefs as well. Yeah. yeah. Chef Sam. Chef Sam. Yeah. Fantastic to meet these guys. They're yeah. actually opening up kitchens. Uh, Where about you? In Dara Salon. In Dara Salon. Yeah. 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 Have you got any name for it? Yeah. Yeah. Piri Frango. Piri Frango. So check out Piri Frango. If you go to Dara Salon. Dara Salon is next to Tanzania, isn't it? Yeah. If you're heading Tanzania way, go to Piri Frango. I will leave a link down below how you can contact them and get more information on it. But wow, fantastic. What a lovely time meeting these guys. Also East African Angie. That's the tunnel. Let's go and get Swahili Kidolo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Swahili. We're going to speak a little bit Swahili just to show you that, you know, yeah, yeah. We, we came from the same tribe even though we're different colours. Oh, <laughs> Karabuni Zanzibar hot style. I've ordered very traditional East African East African bread sort of style things called a mandazi. I haven't had one of these for years. Oh my god. You know what? That was worth waiting for. I also ordered The mixed meat dish, which is it's a very simple dish, meat and chicken with some chips and all barbecued. And I guess the proof of the pudding is in the eating. Well worth, well worth coming to. If there's anything worth coming to barking for, amongst other things, this is definitely worth it. Absolutely amazing, amazing. The flavour, the taste. It's just unbelievable. You've got to come here and try it. Mze, you need chakula, sour, sour, asante sana. Sasa ni me, ni me ko full up. Ni chiba, ni me chiba sana. Lakini chakula chapati. You need, you need asigungi. So there you have it, East African food in Barking. Thoroughly enjoyed that. Well worth a visit if you're in a Barking area. Um, pop down and uh, go to the. Tanzanian styly food place. It's only a little shack, but the food is amazing. I mean, barbecue food at its best. So yeah, this is Chef's Travels. I'm Kevin Harrington. Thanks very much for watching. Catch you on the next one.